Hey everyone, this is Lucky7DX. Welcome back to Let's Play Half Minute Hero Super Mega Neo Climax Ultimate Boy. May as well go ahead and say the full title, because guess what? We're doing a whole new game mode today. So, uh, super exciting. This Today we start uh, Evil Lord 30, because last time we ended Hero 30. So, could you, uh, basically, beautiful Evil Lord. Basically, it's it's the guy that we fought like early on in the game. The guy who was like, I'm an Evil Lord with my, with my lover turned into a bat. Oh no, I'm so handsome. Or beautiful, or whatever he calls himself. But basically, the point is, uh, he's basically the evil lord that we fought before. We're trying to rescue his, uh, his bat lover by summoning monsters for 30 seconds. However, that works. I'm not really sure, but, uh, because like I said, I'm completely blind. What I do know, though, is if you change graphics, uh, there is Evil Lord 30 on Neo mode, but it's only one level, apparently, and it's just a completely different experience. So, while I could, you know, go ahead and do Evil Lord 30 on here, I'm not going to, because it's not the actual game mode. We'll save that for after we complete Evil Lord. That'll be like our Evil Lord extra mode. And, uh, instead we're just gonna go ahead and do it all on retro mode, because that's what the original game was like, and that's how we're going to go ahead and do it. So, so yeah, uh, I guess it's time for us to finally step in here and see what's going on, shall we? I think we shall. Evil Lord 30, begin. So, his canonical name is Evil Lord, and that's cool and all, but we need a name for him. I, I, I I've, w I've gone through a few names, but really, I just... I just have to. I have to call him Hank. Not to be confused with Pirate Hank. This is Evil Lord Hank. For those of you who don't know the story behind Hank, for uh, at some point long ago, I kind of just started naming all my uh, stream characters Hank uh, during streams. So like uh, Pokemon Snap, we had Hank, the protagonist, instead. It's sort of an inside joke between me and Tamal, which I kind of slightly stole from him, to be perfectly honest. But it kind of stuck, and I just love the name Hank. So we're going to call this guy Hank. He's beautiful Hank. He's like... He's like Handsome Jack, but better, because he's Beautiful Hank. Yeah. I don't know, I, ha I have names for the first three. Uh, the, the, the last two game modes, I'm going to have to, to, to think, of, think of something, but... I, w I just want to go Hank. I have to go Hank. It's just... It just feels right to call him Hank to me. Alternatively, I could have called him, like, Locky. Could have been Locky 7 dx but... Hank. It's just the Hank. Ooh, the music is all... Is all wop a dump a dump dump. So, uh, he became an evil lord because he was too beautiful to handle. I'm too pretty for my good. Too pretty for my good. So pretty, it hurts. That was not even, like, remotely close to the song I was trying to reference. Anyway, uh, so he, uh, he met a girl. He reformed. But then he was cursed and then saved. But not, like, but he's still cursed. But, uh, but she's still cursed, so. They have to go ahead to a distant land and begin life anew. A new story of a man enthralled with a monster who uh, has to find a way to break that curse. So apparently this game was a lot shorter than Hero 30, so we'll see how much we can get through in one episode. I'm just gonna aim for about 20-ish minutes, or unless I find like, unless things go fast enough where I can get like 10 of them done, but who knows? Evil Lord 30 begins now. Super hype. Sup, Hank? Beautiful Hank. Hank and Millennia. Oh, she's so, like, she's a cute little bat at least, and the violet tea, oh, she's still such a, my, my lady is so cool, and she also looks like an umbrella, is she like an umbrella? It looks like I'm holding her as an umbrella in the background there, also we have that flower there over there, which is kind of awesome. I love Hank already, he's, he's so fabulous, I, I could have called him Maximilian, that's such a good evil lord name too, evil lord, no, that's okay, his official name is now Hank Maximilian. It's great. It's like it's like the blend of a of a stupid name and a fancy name all at once. So, Violet Castle is all about the purple. Uh, <laughs> yeah, he seems a bit egotistical, but uh, oh, they, oh, he seems he seems very sad that she's still a bat, but uh, at least they have such love together. A cat. Whoa! There's bandits attacking my house, trying to steal my woman's and my flower. How dare you? We are going to shank the heck out of you, because of course Hank would use shanks. Get it? Anyway, uh, this is great. I can make so many puns off this name. That's why I chose Lucky in the first place. It actually is, and it just kind of worked out that way. But, uh, what? You stepped on the flower. You hurt our tea. How dare you? Well, 
we are going to have to kill them. So how does this game mode work? Yes, please tell me. So, uh, three various types of monsters. X for red brutes, uh, who possess great strength, so if we want the strong guys to get the brutes. Z for the blue nimbles, who move very quickly. So, so X is strong, Z is speed, S is shooter. Well, S is shooter is good, but okay. So I guess, uh, three types of humans. So, bandits are nimble types, so magic attacks will be dodged, but brutes will just overpower them. So it's like rock, paper, scissors then. Thank you! Rochambeau is basically Japanese rock, paper, scissors. Or isn't, isn't, that, how, isn't that what it is? I mean, Rochambeau is rock, paper, scissors. Uh, you can see is to command them to charge. Okay, well, let's see how we can figure this out. So, if there well, a bunch of those, we need a whole bunch of brutes. So give us, give us a whole bunch of brutes. Oh, I guess after a while you just get weak ones. Can I get... I can get some nimbles as well, I guess. Except I just... Does it overcome, like... How does this work, anyway? I guess you only have a certain number of guys you can use. Whatever, that's good enough for me. Kill him! Kill! Kill? Kill? Oh! Oh! You have to move around! I thought it was just like, oh, you pick the guys and they go fight. Okay, well, we'll just summon a bunch of, of these guys to go murder everyone. So basically, we just spam the X button and move around and kill everyone. Okay, I I, I may have missed a very obvious part of this match, but uh, I'm apparently, oh, wait, so did I do bad? Oh, okay, so. Did I fail the tutorial? I'm not sure. I feel like I failed the tutorial. No, maybe not. This looks like it's, it's probably things that I could continue to do. So, basically if it's morning, uh, Millennia is bad, and uh, bad things happen to Millennia, who has a really cute bat tail. She's a strange little monster, and I like it. Also, I like this picture of Hank here. It's pretty fantastic. Anyway, uh... Ooh, well, that sounds concerning. Uh... Ooh, a, so her soul trainer monster. Well, that would be... Okay, so her monsterization has begun. We have to save her before she completely becomes a monster. Man, this is a really awesome plot so far. So, uh... Okay, no, we did kill the last human. That's what happened. So, uh... Can't go into the sun. No! We need you, Millennia. So, 30 seconds... So we only have 30 seconds before the sun comes up. And, uh... <laughs> this is true. Pale is the new sexy. Or something. I don't know. So, Millennia Bank? I don't know what that even means. I, I think I just royally effed that up because I didn't realize how that worked, but, uh, regardless, welcome to, uh, welcome to, welcome to, uh, to, to, to the, the game app, I guess. This is super exciting. Also, it says main story, which means there's possibly more, but anyway, Village of the Base, I guess we're just going to keep going because there's not, there doesn't seem like there's much to do. Yeah, it looks like it looks like these are just like the the titles here. Like or I don't think these are like the, I don't think these are things we can get or something like that. I think it's just kind of flavor text, I want to say. Anyway, uh Village of the Base! Attack of the Townsfolk! Break the ugliest statue! Let's do it. So we have 30 seconds again now to destroy everything. Uh strange statue. Well, that looks scary. Uh it is quite hideous. It looks like a statue of Noir, actually. So we shall destroy it. Uh, well, I like my pig's ass. What? So if they're rough, I'm assuming we need to use our magic guys instead. So, uh, also the music here is super intense, by the way. So let's go ahead and destroy this statue. Uh, okay. Well, we're just gonna we're just gonna destroy this town. I mean, we're already evil lord, so sure. Give me a millennia hint. Uh, brute types, so I'm imagining, yeah, nibbles are bad, so we're gonna watch shooters. Okay, so we wanna use S a bunch then. So, uh. Okay, so. Okay, we can attack them if anything. I guess we'll summon a bunch of brutes then, but for now, we head down here, we summon a bunch of shooters to, to mob their face. And I guess I summon a. a, a I'll summon this guy. So, what happens when I do charge? They just kinda charge in a direction? I don't get it. I don't understand charge yet, but that's okay. We're just gonna murder these guys from a distance, and then, 
and then uh, we'll have a we'll have uh, some brutes go and murder this thing. Cool. I still don't quite get the grasp of this game mode. I still really don't understand how charge works, but the music is intense and I love it. So, uh, yes, it's noir. I told you. So uh, we saved the village. We've we've cured the village from uh, from the evil. Yay! So a soldier from the castle has some sort of royal soldier came and brought this down. Interesting. So Noir is alive, and Noir is the way to stop or to save Millennia. So because it was Noir who did that to Millennia in the first place. So mysteries abound. Let's go ahead and continue on. I am a gorgeous evil lord. I still don't understand what the Millennia Bank is. I, I probably am missing something super important here. I hope I'm not, but is it is that like how you, uh... I wonder if the Millennia Bank is like the number of monsters you have left or something. Is there anything like in the, like, can I like... It's pretty much okay, there's not really any options here. Okay, yeah, it looks like these are just like, you know, the, the flavor text. Encounter of soldiers transporting statues! Okay! I guess we're just gonna keep going until we're at like 20-ish minutes or so. Because clearly this is pretty uh, quick here. So, uh... Yeah, we're, we're quite lost, yeah! Haha! -ha, this is true. Except that probably doesn't make much sense. Anyway, uh... We gotta go talk to the... Here, the, the Imperial soldiers! I'm beautiful! Well, gotta go stop the the step. Yeah, can, I, I'd like to I'd like to learn some things from you, Millennia. I'm still very confused. Okay, so, well, yes. Okay. Oh, magic power. Okay. Circle blow rotates your magic power. The more monsters you summon. Okay. Uh. So, maximum circle size equals maximum power. And every time you level up, your mana grows in size. So, ah. So, basically, we can't get hit so we'll lose magic power. It recovers our time and we level up and get more. <laughs> God damn it, Hank! Alright, these guys look like brutes, so I guess we're gonna summon more shooters. Anyway. Oh, that's and that's what the, the pink circle means. Is... So we're just gonna keep a uh, sort of pew-pewing here. Look at these giant monsters I have, they're so awesome! I also feel like I need to maybe swarm them a little bit more here. Okay, so that's why, that's why it takes so long. Uh oh, oh, there's a guy down here! Charge, 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 charge! Kill, 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 kill him! Thank you! Okay, so the soldiers are acting weird. Yeah, gotta go find Noir! Gotta go punch him in the face! Okay, so these levels are obviously super short, but, uh, I still don't know what Millennia Bank means. I'm still very confused by this, but we're, uh, we're, we're learning. It's, I still, I still need to figure out the charge function. I still need to figure out the, everything else. It's still, it's kind of like trial by fire here, but I guess at some point we'll, we'll figure it out. I mean, I'm not trying to get, like, the super perfect clears here. Strange behavior, find the cause! Like I said, we'll just keep going. We'll go up to 10, I think. I think we'll do 10 an episode. And this will be like a three-part sort of evil lord a -thon. So, a good town. They're all lively and... Yep, there's another noir statue. No! No, 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 no. Oh, uh... Uh... Hi, goddess. What are you doing here? Interesting. Oh, you wear okay, well, you don't need to wear the sunglasses, I guess. Yeah, we remember each other, we're... We, we are... We are both egotistical fools. Ooh, flattery. Uh, sure, why not? Okay, so... Noir destroyed the statue. Yes, yes, we did already. The time stop shop. Oh, so that'll stop time, if we get money. So, uh... 30 seconds a night. And we can turn back time! That sounds pretty good, so that's her shop is this golden thing. Okay. Because there's a lot more enemies this time, that's for sure. So, come to you have cash and rewind time. Service costs all that you have, though. Interesting. Interesting, interesting. Ah, The love is in the air. 
Uh, I think these guys are nibbles, so we're gonna summon a whole bunch of brutes that beat the crap out of them. Uh, wait for the men part to recharge. Okay, so we want to do one time, one every time it's big, and we want to destroy the statue as well. Oh, I lost my magic power there a little bit because I got hit. Okay, these are these enemies are infinitely spawning, so we need to come here and we need to turn back time, and then we need a bunch of shooters. Okay, so when you turn back time, you get your magic power back. That's super important to have. Okay, so charge moves them forward to go fight, which probably isn't actually good for our shooters here. But we're gonna go ahead and keep- OW! I didn't see this brute guy over here who dodged all the things. Okay, shooters! Go, shooters! Actually, I should probably restart time. I, 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 can, I can waste a little bit more time here. Go, shooters, go! Go, shooters, go! That's a nimble one over there, though. So, turn back time. And summon a brute to take care of the nimble guy. So I'm gonna shoot take care of this one. And summon a whole bunch of brutes to handle this guy. Uh, who is that thing? Oh, that's that's a soldier. It looks like some sort of weird bomberman sort of guy. So uh, we have destroyed the statue. And that's another level. So it's getting a bit more complicated now that we can turn back time. We have to sort of manage our resources. So super interesting still. Uh. I love the music here, it's so intense! Jeez! Um, so the king. Is a king superior to an evil lord? Question. If yes gets me killed, then no. So the king is having some, uh, some issues here. And, uh, and, uh, uh, yes. Pimples. Yes. Hey, goddess! Uh, goddess spa. Ooh! I like becoming even more beautiful. You're leveling up my beauty, my mana, okay, so give it to Millennia to save up. Ooh, so that's what the Millennia Bank is. You save up enough and you can come to the Goddess Spa and you can uh, level up then, I guess. Is that how that works? Because that's pretty cool, so that's why you don't want to overuse time because the more you save up, the more you can go to the Goddess Spa and level up. Where is the Goddess Spa, though? I'm not entirely sure. I feel like I could have made more money there, but... I'm not sure exactly how that works. I guess we're gonna really want to try to beat the level while getting a whole bunch of extra money. I guess that's what makes sense. Anyway, let's try it out. Small fort, let's go! Hey, there's some archers here. So they're shooters, so we're gonna want Nimbles to fight this guy. So, uh, lots of soldiers. Hey, sup? How's it going? Uh... Yes. Yes. That's how it works. God damn it, Hank, you're fantastic. Uh, ha ha ha! Archers! Okay, so there's archers here. We're gonna want to summon our, uh, yeah, what's up? We're gonna want to summon our nimble guy. Shooter types. So, brutes will be slaughtered. So, summon some nimbles and dodge the arrows. Cannons can be destroyed the same way. Okay. So, we have to kind of go through a giant fortress here of craziness and go from there. So destroy one Noir statue. Can do! Whoa! Excuse me. Pardon me. Pardon me. Hey, I got some lizards. Sup? Hey, want some lizards? I have some lizards. Lizards are good for your complexion. Okay, so we'll summon some brutes to... Oh no, brutes are bad. We want to summon more nibbles for the cannons. Whoa! These are destroying my friends. Or maybe I want some shooters to handle the cannons, because these guys are kind of kicking our ass here. Hi, can we can we undo the the me getting murdered part? Just charge this thing! Okay, I guess we should use the charge button to kinda spam on this. Ow, ow! Jeez, these cans are kicking my butt. What? 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 Who? Huh? What? Where is that? I want I wanna fight, I wanna kill you. Uh uh shooters! Shoot no, we want we want boots. I want give me I don't have any time to turn back. Crap! How do you fight these cannons then? They kind of just murdered my face. Ow, okay, well what happens when you fail? Because I just a bit this abysmally. Uh, that's kind of a really boring failure state. Blah, 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 skip, skippy, skippy, skip, skippy, skip. <laughs> yeah, the cannons are kind of kicking my butt. So I want, okay, I want nimble guys. So wait for max power. Summon more nibbles. You have to kind of. You can't, I can't go right away. If I spam it too much, it's bad for my complexion. So murder all these guys, and then we want to do the same thing, don't we? Just okay. Yeah, charge is the way to go. It seems so. Charge this. 
Charge, 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 summon. I can't move. Why am I? Oh, that's because I was under attack or something. I don't know. Hi, turn back time, please. Uh, these guys look like they're fast, so we want brutes to kill them. Or, oh no, they're, 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 they're our friends. Well, I'm confused now. I don't really understand this game, apparently. Anyway, go, go, murder. I know I don't have super good magic because I got hit, but... Oh, I abominated the fortress, and oh, I got enough to... So I got I got over enough in the bank, right? So I can go get things now, right? Love the smell of evil in the morning. Level up! We got sexier at the goddess spa. I I really don't understand the concept of this game, but it's absolutely gosh darn fantastic. So that's five levels. As much as I kind of want to continue, uh, I think five is a good spot to end here because, well, we're at 21 minutes. I don't want to do another sit of five more. So we're at 21 minutes. We'll do five now. I'm going to just kind of aim for 20 minute videos and see how much it gets to takes to get through this. I get the feeling since we're done through all this tutorial stuff and ex explanations, we could probably get through more like... If, if I'm assuming there's 25 more left, the goal will be to get through about eight. No, the goal is going to be to get through nine or so in the next few episodes. I think that's an adequate goal. We'll see how that works, but this is kind of the intro, and I think we're go going to go ahead and just kind of stick to the there. Or maybe, you know, just get, like, if we have 25 left, maybe just a whole bunch of sixes or something like that, or seven. I think seven. We're going to go for, for seven per episode. That seems like a, like a good plan. Anyway, I don't know. We'll just wing it by ear. We'll see how quickly they go from now on, because they're, they're really short levels. I just need a moment to be confused. This game mode's crazy, though. Holy cannoli. I, I, I don't know how to feel. But, uh, in the next episode, we've taken care of the fort, and we head on to the spirit path, which has a star next to it. Which makes me wonder what that's all about. Interesting. I'm apparently just an er a regular evil lord when I'm this bad at everything. I'm not very good at this yet. It's still a strange concept that I'm still learning a lot. Anyways, Lucky70x sign out. See you all in the next episode for more Half Minute Hero Evil Lord! See you all then. Bye-bye.